box with you. <laughs> Take a walk. We are off! <laughs> Nana's guilty pleasure FM station is the hot 90s. And I really like, have been literally obsessed. just came on as soon I'm as we got in the car. I was so like, embarrassed. But guys, I don't cool. think you should be. It's a vibe. So, girlies, we are. We're off to bath! We're off to pick up our friends now. They're literally on their way to where we're picking them up. So. I'm so excited. We actually haven't seen them in so long. So like the fact that we're doing this and then we're having a road trip and then spending days together is like the most exciting thing. Absolutely the vibes, ladies and gents. We're still parked. We've moved we've moved three times to different spots because we don't know if we're allowed to park. But we're just parked outside someone's house, so hopefully they don't come out and um think we're weird. But yeah, our friends' trains got delayed, so they're gonna be a little bit later. Um, so we're just waiting in the car and it's raining, so it's kind of a vibe. What is it to butter? <laughs> I mean, that's not gonna say that today. <laughs> Nim is just filling in her brows. I wasn't gonna. Oh. Yeah. And we're low key peckish, so we're thinking, like, shall we? Peckish? I'm hungry. Shall we get food while we wait? But then I feel like is is there there's not even a drive through near us, is there? There will be no We're gonna have to find we're gonna have to wait a while. Okay. I think they should be here soon though, because from London Liverpool Street, that's where they're coming from and I don't think it's gonna take them that long to get here. Brow check? Brow Yeah. Now they're just sorting out their luggage back in the trunk. I'm staying in here because it's pouring outside. Guys, me, Alina, and Hannah again. It's been like so long. Hey, hey. Mission Impossible, mate. <laughs> Literally. I can't believe we're united. You got it. We're just in a. What do you call this? MS um, services. services. Just getting some lunch because we didn't eat lunch. The girls were like prepared and they got theirs, but we didn't. Well, how comes every time we meet up, it's hurricane or something? <laughs> <laughs> and we always try and look really cute, but we're actually we're bored. <laughs> bored. <laughs> That's our favourite day when we were all crying about some? something. Ooh, what are they? Check oh, hello. Oh, yeah. It's okay, oh, don't worry. Oh, God, I can't wait. Oh, guys, guys, there's something that I have to really talk to you about. Oh, my God! Crash the car. It's something related to a boy. No! Oh, boy talk, boy talk. The first of all, I have to explain the story, okay? He was a really nice person, but I just wasn't feeling it. Yeah, so, eating them before you <laughs> we used to like sometimes message each other. Like, you know what it is? I thought we were cool. I thought we were like friends and stuff. And um, we'd always like catch up like sometimes, like every like every month or so or whatever. And I thought like it wasn't that deep. Like I thought he knew that where he stood and stuff. Like unless I just gave him like bad flirty signs, which I haven't been. Like I, I wasn't doing that, I thought. Mm -hmm. So... You know how I have this habit of like where whenever whenever I find like job application, I always send it to you guys, right? Mm. Saw so this job which I thought it'd be like good for him because he was looking for a job. So then I sent it to him, and this was like after a while we hadn't spoken because you know I forget to reply, so I hadn't replied to him. But I thought we were cool like that. I thought he wouldn't get offended. So I literally just sent. I was just, just like I popped up and I was like hi, and because I wanted to send him the job application, so I just said hi, and literally guess what he replied to me. What? Maybe you could do the honest. Did he say F up? No, he was like, yeah, no thanks. What? That's all he said. He literally yeah, replied, no yeah, dot dot, dot me? no thanks. Wow, how rude. Rude, fam. I literally just, I, I literally was so confused because I just thought there was no beef. Like, I didn't think there was like. Yeah, he, yeah. you know, he hurt his ego. Mm. Yeah, but like, if, if but I. But you know, up till that point, we had this image that he was just like a nice guy, like, really, like, respected him and stuff. But like taking it well that she like turned him down. No, nice. But the guy. date was like a year real. ago. Like I thought we were cool after no, that, you know? Literally held on to him. <laughs> yeah, like I thought if you had a problem with it, you could have just told me or you didn't have to speak to me and like stop replying. Or to just me don't reply. Yeah. yeah. But the it's fact weird. that it was just like so harsh that he was just like, Yeah, no thanks. Like why would he why would he reply? That's just so to say that. Yeah, because he's he wanted to dig at you. Yeah, yeah. I actually had good intentions because I just wanted to send him the job application in case he was still looking for a job. So I just thought that was so rude. Mm. 
And you hadn't even sent him the job application, right? You were just like, hi, weren't you? Yeah, because I'm not, yeah, I need to just be like, hi. Mm. But yeah, that's that. So I just I thought. I feel like I would have understood if he said, yeah, no thanks to the job. Yeah. Application, but you hadn't even sent the job yeah. application. It was like more like a hi, and he was just like, yeah, no thanks. I just thought oh, so. You hadn't even sent the job application. Yeah. No. That's like bizarre. And I literally was like, what do you mean? Because she was like, what do, what do you mean by that? And he just didn't, he just aired that. So if you just wanted to air me, he could have just... just like, yeah. Air the first one. Exactly. Yeah. I just no, think it's out of order. kind of like boosting his ego because like, she's come calling. But like, mm -hmm. he keeps trying to slide him the end. Yeah. You need to stop being nice, they don't deserve it. I think that's my problem. Like, I get, I'm really nice and then like, I just expect things from back, back from people when I shouldn't be. Like yeah. And like, then I just get let down. <laughs> but <laughs> right, that's it. Everyone's on a men van. Hannah, especially you. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, men are trash. They like are. I don't want to say that because I think it's just a bad mentality to be in. But men just let you down. They just keep proving us ways. right, though. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like if there was someone that proved us wrong, then I'd be like. Mm -hmm. And I feel like men let you down, not even in the romantic sense, in the friendship level too. Yeah, just like they do. yeah. yeah. I mean, Mom says that um, men don't do not make good friends. There's nothing yeah. you can gain from a men, ma male friendship that you can't gain from a female. Yeah. Mm. But what do they do? Honestly, I'd rather call my you girl. Like they literally just make there. you feel like you're being dramatic and you're literally Literally. Yeah. So annoying. But even guys, when they're like best friends, or like best friends, like, like they talk like barely ever. Yeah. yeah. Like, what are they doing with their life? And they're like, oh, I have no fun. They no, don't know. Yeah. I'm like, okay, so they do you actually like each other? They don't randomly give you a call to make sure you're all right. It's like, you haven't messaged me once in a yeah. long time. It's been six months now, I think. Probably an even more. And yeah. So, we just get really let down and I think it it's, it makes us feel like we have such high expectations when we're actually asking for the bare minimum. Yeah. Like, I thought we were cool and like you don't have to do that. It's and like what did you gain out of that from being such a nasty person? Ego. Yeah. And it's so like, it's so weird because it's like we, at, as soon as you told me that, I, it just changed in my eyes. Like, yeah. We just stopped off at the us. services to refresh ourselves. We're going to go to the Costa drive through and get some coffee. Yeah. Although, <laughs> our energy levels need to be upgraded. Iced coffee? Iced How are we going to pay for this? Yeah. I'll get it. And then I'll just Hi, can I grab an iced latte, please? Medium size? Medium size. Iced Thank Americano. You, An iced Americano? Medium as well. I'm going to squeak up and I just like go. Mm -hmm. And then I laugh. And, and I would like a latte. <laughs> At least you couldn't get it I out. I never wanted to be that big. <laughs> <laughs> and now I am. Cutting people off. <laughs> to be fair, it's quite like a toffee nut latte. <laughs> you know what though, that's quite a vibe, I can do that more often. I'll cut off Hannah for my ancestors of when in the white people took over and colonised India, Pakistan. <laughs> and I'm never gonna come back. Wait, you can do that. Doc, doc, doc. Take your coffee. I mean, you don't, you don't know. As soon as it's done with work, it might say have matching trackies. You don't know. You yeah. don't know. It's about the face, though. Remember? No, come on now. Mm -hmm. Guys, can we just say we do not yeah. agree with this? Yeah, we, sorry. we don't know what. We, we don't know who she is. We don't we know, don't who, know who that is. Yeah. Sing to him. <laughs> I would turn off my phone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Emo vibes in the back there. And everything you got destroyed. Thank you. Just the boy. Just the boy. You don't understand. You don't understand. You're ugly. <laughs> You don't understand. Like, you don't dim wit. You don't know. Even the English British version. <laughs> like, you don't know. You don't understand. I love this song. Same. It's such a vibe. Whoa. Another bathroom. We're in Morrison's now and we're gonna do a quick shot so we have stuff for breakfast. The flush. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna have to buy some stuff for breakfast tomorrow and stuff. But yeah, let me just pop into the loo then. Oh, 
sorry. Bullshit. Darlings, we have arrived, but we're struggling because... Oh my god, literally anywhere! Look how big the <laughs> zone is! Oh my god. <laughs> anywhere. Okay, so anywhere. They're basically find. saying we park anywhere we can find. Okay, we're just gonna find parking, just... lovelies. Where shall we try luck? Left or right? Hannah, Let's Alina, pick one. Um, left. This is like you know olden times. If you go left and down, it's Henrietta Road. And shall we go down this road here? Yeah. I we will find a place. Yeah. Everyone sure. manifest. But then the thing is that we're gonna have to be carrying all our stuff. Here. Yeah, that's, that's kind of annoying. Rock. I just thought it was gonna be like. Oh, right we should have dropped our stuff there. Yeah, because we have so much. Should have just found a parking spot. <laughs> We, we could have settled in <laughs> while you were struggling around. Yeah, put the kettle on. <laughs> put the kettle on. This is our lovely Airbnb. So, the reason that we couldn't really do a tour, we'll do a tour a bit later when we settle in. We're struggling. But we don't know how to turn the main lights on. The only ones we can get working is down there. But look how cute that swing is. I'm going to sleep in that thing. <laughs> No, but you're too skinny. You get back it's up. So it's really comfy, isn't it? Not me, just sitting here. What is that? Look at that bedroom. Look at that bedroom. Look at that bedroom. Oh my god, I love this. It's kind of scary though. It's kind of like Greeky though. Yeah. <laughs> it's scary. This is Morocco time. Literally, where are the lights everywhere? Come <laughs> on. Oh my god, this is where Minnie and Denise are. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh my god, guys, our rooms are right next to us. Yeah, that's you. Oh, of course, the first thing I do is lie in bed. There's a few Our rooms are like right next to each other. So this is our room. And then um, that. Or oh, do you guys want this room? What do you guys want? Yeah, I don't really mind. We don't mind. And I'm like, I've got my own room, thank like. Oh yeah. We had the kids' room in our house. Okay. These oh, are the no, just end. Oh, no, it oh my god, Hannah, I'm scared. I'm scared as well. Look, you're scared. Wait, what's this? I'm scared. Is it locked? Oh, wait, what is it? It's probably upstairs. Really? How's your food? I love mine. How's your McDonald's, Hannah? Tastes like McDonald's? It does taste like McDonald's. Right, like we are about to unpack. So we've got the light on. Now we can see the room more clearly. Look how gorgeous this area is. So that's literally where you come in. That's As soon as you come in, you have the living room. We did even do a tour earlier. It was like all messy. But in here, you have our toilet. Which is like small and cute just a toilet nothing to really say but you go in here and this is the coolest part this is the shower room doesn't this give you like spa vibes Literally. so you come out and then you go further into the house and you enter the dining area and it's got these statement stairs but you can't go up here because we're in the basement level floor. yeah so you go in here we have our kitchen with which we've already kind of turned into a mess we bought some snacks and breakfasty stuff we put here got our dishes everything of this house just a vibe 
We're gonna have like a chill night in the Yeah. Come back in and you take a shop, right? You enter the bedrooms. I don't know what the girl is up to, so we're not gonna show you. Oh, then here's. We're all taking our makeup off. The rest of the girls have all taken the makeup off. Excuse me, bro. Excuse me. I don't think you're gonna pull my hair. So I. Ignore that. So I'm gonna basically take my makeup off as well. We're just having a chill night in for the first night. And we popped into Morrison's earlier to get some wine for the night. This is the only board game that is in our Airbnb. We've been chilling. Minimala being a studious person, she used to work. Hello, knock knock. Not gonna get that degree. Do you love Breezy? Not gonna lie, I know you're really problematic person. Yay, let's play. Guys, we're no. playing this game, and no. this is the thing. And I've just chosen Tanisa and Hannah to do this. Basically, this was the game. This was the game. See? Now you silly. Morning, everybody. It's Good morning. Lovely. First morning. My first morning here, I've been up for a while. Everyone's up now, and we're just gonna take turns to get in the shower. It's 9.14 and we're up. We're planning to get out by 11. First day here, we're just gonna explore, mm -hmm. eat good food. We, we have, have a, sorry, I'm sorry. We have a table off. booked for yeah. dinner tonight at six. How exciting. So I've been working on my project even when I'm here because my deadline's approaching. It's kind of silly to have this, oh. So, look at my, this is what I'm working on right now. How cool. If you recognize, you know, you know. Don't call me baby. Call me money. Guys, they keep, like, everyone keeps making, like, really scary, like, Jokes, everyone's like, Oh, yeah, there's a hobbit in the house, like making like jokes about the noises, like someone trying to break in and stuff. And I want to say, creeped out, like, we should save those jokes for when we're about to leave. <laughs> this morning, like, I got woken up by my body against my will, and I thought, I can't do this. I'm trying to be close to you. Oh, me and Millie are the last ones to go in the shower just because we said we would be the ones that would take the shortest amount. Plus, we're just doing our hair because we're not washing our hair today. We're greasies! So, I needed the greasy hair because I'm, I just curled my hair. And Minnie's gonna try and do a sleek ponytail look. How's it going? I'm gonna do a sleek bun. I feel like that's a, that's my better vibe. Because I never know how to. Okay. Yeah. I never know how to curl my friends when Minnie always has to do it for me. Jesus, that you're gonna learn how to do it because remember when I used to um, do your eyelashes as well? <laughs> I never used to be able to do my eyelashes and then you still have to like, I used to do my all my makeup and then Minnie used to like stick it on for me. <laughs> That's so weird. You know when I was at um, Nika's sister's party? I yeah. Was doing everyone. I know, I remember you saying that you are doing everyone. How's everyone lined up? Come on, get your lashes done. So cute. I love those vibes of like getting ready with your friends, don't you? Yeah. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, like I'm just not in the best place mentally lately, so I keep having to cry every single day. I'm just so weak. I had a major breakdown yesterday with my friends as well. But like it needed to happen. And I'm glad it happened on the first night. I didn't really like this one was looming, but like they knew something was up. And I think they were like nice to talk about it. Yeah. I think they wanted to know, but you know when you don't want to force someone into talking. So yeah. The mood isn't down because I keep going from like low to high, so I'm okay, like I'm fine right now, but the cold doesn't help, I feel like, you know, it's, uh, I sound more like... You sound way more like upset than you are. Like, I am. Yeah. Like if you were here but right now... that makes you us more upset, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I feel bad. No, I don't think so. I feel, I feel guilty, but... I think it's better like to share that feeling with other people, like you can't expect to just fight through like the hardships in your life on your own and i think when you do that it's like it lessens the burden on yourself as well yeah i do and, like, appreciate you don't have to be like you just be selfish sometimes as well like you have to think about the effects just let it out we're go. out people finally we were just taking pictures but um we're out 
We're heading to the town center. I need food. We are now at Mrs. Is this Pot's your work, guys? Yeah. Pot 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 house. We stopped at the Cascara now, which is we a place that we came before. It's a vegan cafe. And it's stunning food. Homegirls not feeling too great. Nah, no, not feeling the vibe. You know when you just like don't feel too good about yourself, but like, everyone else just thinks you're so beautiful. But you know when if you don't feel it, then it's like no point. Yeah, like, I don't no care words, like what other people yeah. think is what us inside really. But look how stunning she is. But anyways, we're still waiting for our drinks. <laughs> We came here last time and it was such a good cafe, but there's no oh, seating, so we're just waiting outside. This is divine. I accepted it. I accepted it. I love mini strikers. <laughs> you do it again. <laughs> I literally did. Oh, nice guy, I got them. Got it? Yeah, thank you so much. Can you see one as well? Yes, please. Your hair, your hair and this coat look so good together, Mini. Yeah, she looks so good with a high bun yeah. as well. Oh I think it's because she's got like a small forehead. So Don't tell me. Why? We're about to go into the market. So we just made a spontaneous decision. <laughs> decision to get on the boat. So we just came to the bridge, Portini Bridge, to see, and then we saw there was a boat, <laughs> boat ride happening. So Alina was like, oh, "I want to get on the boat." <laughs> so we just voted that we will. Oh my god, I'm fully vlogging. I hope you guys are proud of me. It's gonna be cute though. We wanted to come in last time here. Yeah, the space is always taken. Yeah. How pretty. <laughs> <laughs> This is a We're fully on the boat, Hannah. How do you feel? And, um, I never met it. Hannah's like, what the hell? Hannah's so like, not sure about stuff. She's like, boat. Look, <laughs> Hey guys, this is my idea because I just think YOLO and like, if you want to go on a boat, you should go on a boat. And if you want to drive the boat, you should drive it, even if you don't know how. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <They're> like, <laughs> that we don't die. That would be fun. The background is insane right now. So this is like the famous Poutine Bridge. This is so insane. Move in! Oh my god. Here we go, guys. Let's go. Pirates of the Caribbean vibes. <laughs> you went in there. Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh my god, we're going under. <laughs> we just went under the bridge. Wow, lighting is moving mad as well. So cool! We're back home, guys. Just having a quick little one shoot. We got um, some food from the waitress belly vibe. I got chicken gaezas. It's six o'clock guys, so we're about to leave. Our, our table's booked for 6.15 I believe. Um, so yeah, we don't want to be late, but this is the look for today. So my makeup and I've got a mini dress. Uh, <laughs> what are we all wearing? Oh, we're all wearing clothes. Yes! <laughs> today we decided not to go out and hike it. <laughs> <laughs> so the girls are staying inside there today, everyone's like, you know what? We're like, no, what? We're going to out. We're going to out. We're going to 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 did you feel like jail? That walk felt like jail. It did, it did. I'm not gonna lie, it felt long. Yeah, it was my hair was like non existent. <laughs> <laughs> when her hair was like that light colour, which was kind of colour. I was really sure she didn't have the one <laughs> with alcohol. Like, Cheers, <laughs> Danny. Mini's was. Mini's was. Our mates are here. <laughs> I'm excited for 
So we're just getting dinner, yeah, and suddenly there's this couple behind us who are literally so lovely. We just start talking and literally it feels like we're like their long life friends. Yeah. And literally we were talking, saying how like Minnie was saying how she missed graduation. She was gonna she's gonna miss graduation this year. And then they just pour us a bottle of wine. Thank you so much. We love the couple. It's our dessert. So we've like overstayed our welcome. <laughs> so this <laughs> Here's to our friendship. What is it like? Oh, Oh, that was so good. That was such a good night, honestly. Good. Mini had cannolis. <laughs> cannolis. And did you say you liked them? Yeah, I did actually. I really liked them. And then I had like this ice cream, semi freddo. Was it good? This is freddo. I fed her. She fed me. I freddo her. Yeah. And um, yeah. And then where are we going after this? My little barber at home. I'll, I'll, I'm happy to go. <laughs> Whatever you guys want to do. Um, yeah. Like, if you guys want to go to. We should go home. We should go lie down and drink everybody gay. Yeah, no, she will. She loves karaoke. Nims, you like karaoke, don't you? Guys, do you want to go home and do karaoke? <laughs> I need to look at this. <laughs> Why can I not see your nose at all when you do? I'm not gonna lie, we are tipsy. <laughs> Why would you do an answer? Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> it's really good in there. Yeah. Get the linguini. <laughs> Have a good night. Why are we besties with everyone? <laughs> Mine looks out for me. Yeah, I'm like, what is that? I don't know. Cheers. <laughs> we just came out the bar and now we're, we got an Uber because we actually couldn't hack the walk even though it was all that long. So now we're going in the house. Oh, Hannah the lifesaver. <laughs> At uni, I used to do all broadcast journalism all the time, and everyone was just like, Get a lady now to do it, a lady now, and I'd have to go up and be like, Lena Minir presenting. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking news, we have just had this breaking news back in Bathwick. We're gonna head back over to our correspondent live in Bathwick. Alina Munir. Hello and welcome back to Channel 5. It has been just been reported in that there's been breaking news that the citizens of Bath have gone mad and the, the Romans have come back to life and they're now murdering everyone in the Roman Bath. Yes, yes, it is, sounds like a natural history museum Vibes, that film. What's that film that Ben Nine Stiller in? Hold on, yes, I'm getting something. Yes, oh, you're not in the museum. Yes, that That's hilarious. Historical figures are now alive and murdering innocent civilians. Is it a sign of the times? Made it, made it, made it. We yes, have yes, it is. Yes. Wait, hold on. There's some information for the civilians. If you are a civilian, you could be in danger. Get inside now. I repeat, get inside. Oh my god. <laughs> We are now heading over to the museum itself, Roman Bath, our correspondent mini wanna be. <laughs> I'm stuck in here. I can't really look what's happening. I'm scared. Help! <laughs> we are arrived in Morrison's. It feels like hella, it's actually not. It's actually not hella, man. It's not hella. Packing up our stuff. <laughs> Breakfast. I'm so excited for breakfast. I'm so hungry. Literally, literally starving. Oh. Walking back home now. It's such lovely weather, and it said it was gonna rain. So. I don't think it's gonna last me. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that's why I'm like, let's just enjoy the sun while it's here. But yeah, we're walking back home now. <coughs> Got the goods for breakfast. Hydrate yourself. This guys. point. Oh yeah, now it's got a massive bottle. Because you know what we're like, we just drink a lot. Guys, that street is so beautiful. We always used to see it last time as well. It's so nice. Turn round. We're eating. Got ready. This is my outfit for today. I've got the yellow version of that brown dress on. And I've just got this leather jacket. 
my usual favorite primer bag, sunglasses and this mushroom choker pearl necklace from ASOS. Um, yeah, let's go. It's raining. We just got here. We're on time. Uh, go. Let's go in. <laughs> The switch. I mean, you was just crying about how she needs to do work. It's not focused. It's not focused. Oh, it's focused. I have a deadline in three days. Hi, We're at Dole. We've been wanting to like, try this pizza place since we had last time. There's actually a lot of good pizza places in. No, there's a lot of good Italian places in Bath. Yeah. So it was either this or this other pizza company that we chose dough because they have like this ranges of dough bases you can choose but we were so boring it's a little gluten free you can get like turmeric, seaweed, hemp but yeah we were just boring and got like um, we decided to just get the Mediterranean pizza the Mediterranean pizza but in gluten free base and we also decided to start drinking uh -huh. It is past 12 It's alright, it's lunch. If I'm gonna get a That's cocktail, I, I, yeah, I was kicked by some martini. What did you get? That looks really good. The weather's not really, obviously, yeah. the vibe, but it's the vibe. I love going to martini. Alcohol. Alcohol. Mine's really alcoholic, so alcohol like antibacterial gel alcohol you try one like disinfectant alcohol oh really mm, all tasty mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that food is <laughs> we're having a breakdown <laughs> It looks so yummy though. We got the Mediterranean and the Vegetarian Hub. It's been an ongoing joke in this weekend, like we're adding Anna to like everything. And the way that the Vegetarian pizza was called Vegetariana is the funniest thing ever. Pizza's massive. I don't know if you can hear us, but it's massive. Wow. Look at the gift shop and see if they have any t-shirts. We're massive. gonna all watch I didn't eat dinner. <laughs> We're in this cafe now. We just met up with Aline and Hannah, who just Another went to Rome and Bath. We got a latte. And I got a shop mini. Because we were going to come in and sit with the girls, but it felt a bit. Oh, we went into HMV and I treated mini to. What did I treat you with, mini? You were gassed about it. She was doing that thing, was like, oh, no, no, don't do it. Yeah. So cute. What's he called? Oh yeah. Can I hold him? He's stuck in the box. Can I hold the box? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we were just walking home. We just stumbled across this park, and I just saw that little water thing in there. Can we go have a look? Should we just walk around? Yeah. We're not in a rush. We're just walking home. The girls have decided to go to Urban, so we said we'd walk home because we didn't want to go. And it's. <gasps> Wow, it looks really pretty. It's kind of a romantic vibe. Yeah. Oh my god. No, this is stunning. This might be the high part of it. So stunning. <laughs> Senti. Senti Kumar. Now we're in the restaurant for dinner. We're in the Nepali restaurant called Yag Kinti Yag. Oh and look at the way she traditionally pours the drink. <laughs> Damn, I never seen nobody put it down like her. We got a salmon sedula, we've got vegetable momo, and we've got chicken, chicken kyoyo. Fikua. This is the first time our friends are having Nepali food, is it? No, I had it at your house. Okay. Hannah, is this your first time? Hello! Charles, we're home. Right, to explain the story, we were at the restaurant, right? What's the and story? The food wasn't like that great. Oh, I didn't, I didn't like, like it. Here. Can I tell them? Okay. Yeah. Back is flash no. Um, yeah, basically, I thought that, because it was the first time me going to a Nepali restaurant, and I thought that it was going to be... Um, like my mum's cooking. Yeah, because I only had two nieces and mum's, and I thought it was going to be like proper curry curry, and because I don't eat meat, 
like that. I yeah, there's like, no fish options except yeah. like one starter. The starter was delicious. Don't it was like eating a bit of cauliflower and, yeah. that, and then. Like, but there was like a lot of veg options, and I'm okay with it because that's what I'm used to. But Alina's like not. And then I, because it's not halal, that's what she was reduced to. So yeah, she didn't have a good experience. And then the vibe just fell off because it we tried to get Uber home. He cancelled on us my, after making us wait for like 20 minutes. We had already paid the bill, so I then it, it's like they were kind of waiting for us to like leave. So it kind of felt awkward. <laughs> Let's get in bed because it's the last night. I just said that. Wait, you're squashing. Where's my? Sitting on him. Yeah, it's like you're squashing the chicken. Well, it's massive on camera. It's tiny. It's tiny, it's tiny. tiny, tiny <laughs> so cute. Morning, guys. So it is the day we are leaving. Sad, but um, yeah, we need to leave by eleven, and it's ten forty-six. Oh wait, I know, I know one that I don't like about fashiony. Yeah. Men who wear rolled-up jeans. Oh yeah. Um, <laughs> not a vibe. But that that just means he's short. Skinny, light wash jeans and rips it. <laughs> acid wash. Acid, acid wash. wash. Oh my god, acid wash is the worst. What do you guys think about chinos? All oh, men. Uh, <laughs> somebody call <can't> nine <have> one. <laughs> My man's just wearing chinos. I don't mind chinos. Now that I think about it, I don't like chinos either. Chino sh shorts. Ugh. Chino shorts, chino trousers, I don't care. I like it. Well, not the all year barbecue look. <laughs> <laughs> I just think it's been really fashionable men. Look good on Insta, but if I saw them in real life, it's like, too much. It's cringe. too much. You're a man. Which is my beanie. I've just pictured a look I don't like: white shirt, then checkered pants and loafers. Oh. But you can see the ankle. I I'm not like that. Oh, that, that. Yeah, and very... brown belt, even worse. I don't like anything. <laughs> What do you think about oh, one puffer? Oh. I'm like, he just got a puffer. He's naked. <laughs> Bare legs. Just don't like your boxer shorts. <laughs> Take, Take him off. Him away right on that note, guys, we will be going. Wow, um, I hate everything. Guys, we're gonna end the vlog what... here because we're just gonna go home and die. That's it. So. We're gonna end the bath vlog here. Thank you for watching the vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. We had the best Say bye, weekend. Bye, everybody. Let's bye from Alina and Hannah. Bye. <laughs> bye, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.